Welcome back everyone, Eric Bolts here, TPI Fitness Professional at Cedar Bray. We're here for part two of, the, of our series of exercise, fundamental exercise to improve our ability to separate the upper from lower body, okay? The swing, the swing sequence from the top. So, the next exercise here is a lying pelvic approximation or pelvic rotation. Okay, so this is the pelvic approximation. So you're gonna lay down flat on your back. You're gonna bring one knee up to 90 degrees. Now the idea here is to try to rotate your pelvis by using your core, right? I'm going to try to use this quadrant here on the right side between my rib cage and my pelvis to flex and engage and then push or rotate the pelvis across your midline, not too far, bring the shoulders down and then coming back to center. Now I wanna to try to keep my leg and my inner thigh out of this movement. So I really wanna focus on maybe flattening the low back a little bit, feeling the flex in the core here and using that to push the pelvis into rotation. Now do that nice and controlled. If you feel like the inner thigh is working a lot, then that's probably because we don't know how to fire this abdominal on the other side. I'm just gonna practice, I'm gonna rotate, maybe hold, maybe even dig your fingers into this area here so your body knows where you're supposed to be engaging from. We're gonna work five to 10 repetitions going one way, and obviously we're gonna go the other way, fire this section over here, this quadrant on the left, and push the pelvis into a rotation, keeping the leg nice and quiet. Okay, so we're trying to gain control and subconscious awareness of these muscle groups so that we don't have to think about it on the golf course. We'll catch you guys next week with some more tips on how to improve your body swing connection.